All right, I'm here with head coach Eric Solberg. The Lady Lions just grabbed the one to Neil Wynn over time to State Coach. Just give us an overview of the outcome. Yeah, you know, I thought we played a complete team game. Our preparation was great this week. You know, we played pretty well on Thursday, even though the scoreline didn't show it. Um, you know, I think today was about me getting out of the way and letting the team lead from within and just, just take ownership over the result and the performance. And, you know, we talk about performance more than results. Um, and today, we're fortunate the performance led to result, and it was a great, great full team performance, the best one we've played yet. And um, just, I couldn't be more proud of the team. Like, uh, it was a total team effort, and uh, really, really proud of our staff, from the athletic trainers to you guys to everybody who makes this possible. You know, there's some tough days, but this makes it all worth it. Brisha Masungu, talk about Brisha. Brisha has been the defensive catalyst for some years on this Lady Line squad. Um, not having a collegiate goal a season ago, to yeah. having two collegiate goals and the game winning goal today. Yeah. Just give you an overview on Brisha and her improvement over there. Yeah, I mean, she's she was a two year captain now for us in her third season. Um, you know, if. If you know her as a player, she's an even better person. And, and so for her to have the success she's had this year is tremendous. I'm so proud of how she's led this team. But also, I mean, we kind of joke sometimes that she puts the team on her back, and today she did. She, we got one corner, I think, the whole game, and we scored it. And that was the difference in the game. And, you know, I just appreciate her taking ownership over the results and taking care of business. But really proud of her development. And uh, she's just a great team leader, and we wouldn't be where we are without her. And, uh, I mean, that can be said for, for most of our players and, and just really proud of of getting the outcome that we that we did today, and, and she's a big reason for it defensively, but it's good that she uh, found the game winner today as well. Coach, talk about this game and how this carries the momentum going forward. Yeah, I mean, it's a team that beat us 6 nothing at their place last year, and so for us to have redemption today and and take care of business was was immense. Um, and so hopefully we can just take this, you know, I'm not a, I'm not a big picture person in some ways. Like, I want to take things one game at a time, and today, like, we're just going to enjoy this one for a few days, and then Get on a plane, we got a, a, two more tough teams on the road to close out non-conference, North Dakota, North Dakota State, and we're just going to take them one at a time, make sure we give a maximum effort in each game, and I uh, hope we have another feeling like we're experiencing today with getting a, a big, massive win for our program. I think it's the first time we've won back-to-back -back D1 non-conference games since, like, 2010, 2011, so it's, it's, it's huge. You know, I think it, it's, it's great. Like, as a coach, you know when your team's making progress and when you've arrived, but it's great when you're rewarded for it and everybody else can see it, too. Coach, we thank you. Congrats on the win. Thank you. Say, say bye. <laughs> okay. Bye. Thanks, guys.